All right, this is going to be a cat bag removal and install on a 2010 Dodge Challenger. This is actually going to be the uh, mostly through uh, a talk through. Uh, this is not the original exhaust system. However, it does have the uh, original exhaust clamps. So a note that the uh, bolts for the exhaust clamps are 15 millimeter, which you will need. And then the bolt that goes to the exhaust hanger arm is going to be a 13 millimeter and then you're going to have two hanger arms that don't come off there's going to be a total of six hanger arms but two that don't come off at all that are right up by the center of the cutback exhaust and what I'll do I'll show you right inside there you can see how those don't come off there and there. So what you'll have to do is get yourself a utility knife, because I don't like working in confined areas trying to, to squeeze them off. You'll be fighting with them all day. And just cut along the edge so that you can get them off. What I did was I already loosened the bolts for the clamp up front, cut off the exhaust hangers back here, and I left this exhaust hanger so I can show you what I was talking about about getting yourself a utility knife. So you just get yourself a utility knife and you can cut right in along the side here. And just work your way through it to get through the exhaust hanger. Just like so. You can twist that up and again cutting here to get through your exhaust hanger. Which you can see I'm already fighting with the utility knife. You may imagine what, what it's going to be like Having to get that off. And once you get it sliced all the way through, just grab it, yank it off. And we have one too. And this stud, or this bolt right here, going to be a 13 millimeter. You'll probably want to drop this down a little bit later when you're doing the install. Now what I did is I had already loosened up the, the bolts at the front. I didn't do any of the other mid mounts because I'm hoping to do the, the quick uninstall, which is once I loosen the, the bolts up front, I leave all the other exhaust clamps intact. I cut off all of my other hangers which I didn't cut these off yet because I wanted to, to get there and show you what what we're talking about so we'll go ahead and start cutting these off here and there the exhaust is now off on that side jump over to This side, we'll go ahead and we'll cut this one off. And there goes the exhaust, down in one piece. All I need to do is grab, give it a grab, give it a yank, which hopefully this should pop off. in one unit. Oh. And that's why I'm replacing the exhaust.
in, there it goes. And that is how you do a quick cat back exhaust on install. You do your two mid pipe mounts, leave the rest in clamped, unclamp all your connectors or all your hangers, and then once you get on the back end, wiggle it and yank it off. All right, wait for the next video, which is uh, doing the install. Thanks for watching.